going to go get the cows a bell of hay with the new light bar. All right, so here we have the visual of my regular headlights. You get a little better when you got the fork down, but as you can imagine, when you have a hay bale on here, you can't see very well. And here is our bat. None at all if I take my foot off the brake. And here's my switches over here. You can't really see. But there it is. And if I turn the headlights off, they are pretty much the same, honestly. The headlights will help a little bit, but then behind me, I'm going to turn this on. There we go. And there we are with the work light. So, yeah, as you can see, dramatic improvement. All right. So this is what I normally see. With just the headlights getting in there. And this is what you see taking it to the cows. What I usually end up doing is uh, standing up and kind of looking past it. I'm using well, my flashlight and all. So let's call it a light bar. There we go. Yeah, I'd say that's a bit better. So yeah, I'm thinking the uh, light bar is worth the uh, time and money that I put into it. It's uh, honestly not an expensive bar. I got it at O'Reilly's for like 60 or $70, and it is definitely... I can have it down a little bit more. There we go. But yeah, it's uh, definitely worth the money, in my opinion, for, you know, doing this kind of stuff. A lot of times during winter now, it's usually dark when I get to give them the bale of hay, so I can't see very good. And uh, this, this is definitely going to look good. And then if I have any other projects that I have to do in the dark, I'll be glad that I've done it. Uh, it took a while to install, uh, just trying to run the wires uh, the way I want it to without being in the way of getting, you know, hit or broken or anything like that. Run down through the floorboard and, you know, up through the engine compartment into the battery. The battery's all the way in the very front behind the headlight. So I had to go all the way up there. Uh, so other than that, wasn't really too bad. I uh, installed the bar up there with a couple of self tapping metal screws. You know, instead of bolts, I mean, it'll hang fine. It's not a heavy bar or anything like that. So. But anyway, uh, this particular bar, we've got one little place in the middle of it for um, like spotlight type, like a, you know, headlight shining in one spot. And then the two sides are more of a flood design, so it's kind of designed to give you the best, you know, all around. Best the best way of fight scenario, but yeah. So you stand up, I'm kind of blocking the bar, but it is standing up pretty good. Uh, definitely an improvement. So that's all for this one. They prayed up, prepped up, and strapped up. See you.